What it is guys, my name is Swifters, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys some of the best rare and secretive paint colors in GTA 5 Online. In today's video I'm going to be showing you some awesome color combinations that hopefully you guys can put on your cars and impress your friends or anyone else in the GTA 5 Online sessions. Now as always, for those of you who do go on to enjoy today's video, all I ask is that you'd slap that like button and subscribe to my channel for some of the best daily GTA 5 content, including tips, tricks, glitches, news, and more. With that said, let's get started. Now I'm going to be showing you guys these paint colors in the GTA 5 story mode just because everything inside of Los Santos Customs is so inexpensive, however you guys can acquire these colors in the online session. So obviously go ahead and take the vehicle that you're going to be spraying over to Los Santos Customs, in this case I'm going to be using the Zentorno, however you guys can use any vehicle that you would like. Now the first paint color that I'm going to be showing you is a variation of the bright candy red color, so scroll down to your metallics and you're going to want to apply a formula red as the primary base. As soon as you do that, back out of the metallics, scroll down to the pearlescent, and you're going to want to apply an ultra blue pearlescent on top of the formula red base. This is going to make the car look extremely bright, but from here you guys can go to your secondary colors and you're going to want to go ahead and apply a metallic candy red. This is going to bring the colors all in together and mesh very very well. All in all, this is a very sexy looking paint job, and you guys can go and head to the wheel color and change the wheels to a black, a red, or a variation of a pink. All in all, this is a very awesome looking paint job, especially if you get it in the right light under the sun. Now this next paint job that I'm going to be showing you, I don't really know what to call it, so I'm just going to go ahead and call it the Stargazer paint job. So go ahead and scroll down to your respray option, go to your metallics, and you're going to want to apply a dark blue as the metallic primary base. From here, back out of your metallics, scroll down to your pearlescent, and you're going to want to apply a Torino red as the pearlescent tint on top of the dark blue primary base. This is going to make the car look very very shiny and give it sort of a purplish pinkish vibe to it but from here you guys can go and head over to your secondary colors and you're going to want to go ahead and go to your metallics and from here you guys can go ahead and apply a hot pink or a pipster pink on the vehicle. It is personal preference, I do prefer the hot pink over the pipster pink. Now regarding the wheel color, I recommend using a hot pink, however, black works best with every single paint job. It is up to you, it is personal preference. All in all, this is a very outstanding looking paint color, very shiny, very sleek, and it does remind me of the Nebula paint job. For those of you who don't know, I was the one who actually created the Nebula paint job and uploaded it to YouTube a couple of months ago. The next paint job that I'm going to be showing you is a coral green, and I know a lot of you guys were asking for a good green paint job, so in order to obtain the coral green respray, go to your metallic section of the respray option, and you're going to want to apply a sea green as the primary base. The sea green by itself is very ugly looking, but from here, go to your pearlescent option, and you're going to want to apply a dew yellow as the pearlescent tint. This is going to change the color of the car completely, but from here, go to your secondary option, and you're going to want to apply a bright green as the secondary color. This is going to add all different shades of green to the car. Now for the wheel color, we're going to use something that pops, but we're going to be using a different shade of green. So for the wheel color, I recommend using a pea green. However, like every single paint job, you guys are more welcome to go with a simple black. All in all, this is a very sexy looking paint color, especially because there aren't that many awesome green looking paint jobs. Now for the final paint job in today's video, we're actually going to be going with another shade of green, but this one is going to be the kick-ass paint job just like the superhero. So go and scroll down to your respray option, go to your metallic section, and you're going to want to apply a dark green as the primary base. From here, go to your pearlescent option, and you're going to want to apply a race yellow as the pearlescent tint. This is going to make the car look really cool with this awesome green tint, having green, yellow together, they mix very very well. Now for our secondary color, we're just going to go with a simple metallic yellow along with the wheels. Both our secondary color and our wheels are going to just be a simple metallic yellow this is going to bring out the car very very well and if you guys want if you're using the Zentorno you guys can go ahead and add the stripe down the hood of the vehicle this is going to make the car look really really awesome but all in all this is probably my second favorite paint job of today's video the first one has got to be the stargazer blue now other than that guys that's all you do have for you in today's video i hope you did enjoy it and if you did be sure to leave a like and subscribe for some of the best daily gta 5 content including tips tricks glitches news and more be sure to let me know in the comment section below which paint job was your favorite and also let me know if you guys would like me to post more paint job videos on my channel. Until next time guys, this has been Swifters, I'm out, peace.